Hello, my name's Sean, and it's my birthday today. It is November 11, 2011, and I am turning 18. That's a pretty epic birthday, right? I thought I'd document 11 past 11, because, you know, at 11 past 11 on 11, 11, 11, the world could potentially explode. We don't know this, and I'm gonna document it for you right now. My uh, backyard and house has been set up for my birthday party tonight. That's at 7 p.m. though. 7 p.m. 11, 11, 11. There's nothing really cool about that. I am going to have my birthday cake and blow out my candles at 11 past 11 tonight. But technically, that's 23, 11. So I can still bull crap it. Forgive my ugliness right now. I haven't showered or anything. So what was my first thing I did as an 18-year-old? I read a book and went to bed. I also brushed my teeth. It was pretty ordinary, really. I better check the time. Now we're good, we're still good. Why did I start this video so early? I know, this is very, it's an incredibly boring video. You can just deal with that. There's gonna be cooler videos. This is out on a limb. This is just me going, you know what? I'm gonna film it going to 11 past 11, record a little bit of history for you. So if the world does explode, it'll be documented. They can make this into a movie. You know the guy playing the new Spider-Man? He can play my part. How does he do this in 127 hours? You know that movie, 127 hours, where it's just the guy with the video camera? That must be an incredibly boring movie. I haven't actually seen it, so I can't comment. It's 11 or s You can't actually see that. There's just no point to doing that, is there? It's 11 or 7. It's, it's intense, it's intense. What if we're all dead after this? I reckon it could end right now. And all those people be like, oh damn. Here we were thinking that the world was going to end in 2012, but no, no, they fooled us. It was so much earlier. Ha ha ha, oh, we'll laugh about this later. It's now 11 at 10. And we're still alive. We almost missed that. No nuclear explosions, no natural disasters happening. Uh, I'm sorry. It was a bit of a bit of an anticlimax there. I think I'll just go now. I'd, uh, I have no idea how to end this.